The dapper young man sporting a bright red bow tie stood out from the crowd of high school summer graduates. Calvin Jordan's journey to this commencement ceremony was delayed by a tragic twist of fate. A fiery SUV crash that killed a friend and left Calvin in a coma. For Calvin, it was touch and go, but his strong will prevailed. He was released from the hospital four weeks after the accident. It's been a long journey, but I just, I stayed focused. It's basically a mindset. It's, it's a mindset, so you have to keep your mind positive and focused and things, great things will happen in life. So I'm not done living my life, so I want to be a very successful young man. Faculty, friends, and family already consider Calvin a tremendous success. Relatives attended the graduation wearing t-shirts proclaiming Calvin Man of the Year. We all pray for a miracle in this afternoon. He's walking across the stage to receive his well-earned high school diploma. Calvin Jordan! Perhaps the relative cheering the loudest was Calvin's mom, who in May originally accepted Calvin's diploma. Calvin is presently hospitalized. Accepting on his behalf is his mother. On that day, Kenya Ward only dreamed of this day. The boundless love between this mother and son is undeniable. When I seen him with his cap and gown on, I was bawling, bawling, just crying. It feels good, though. Tears of joy. And more joy is ahead. Calvin plans to attend college and then dedicate his life to helping others. Well, I'm planning on being a physical therapist. A healer who will draw from his own triumph over tragedy. Claudia Shea reporting for the Education Network, keeping you informed.